What's going on, everybody? DJ Goham here. Welcome back to the channel. It's Fimes of News, baby. It's Dave Fimes of Dark. Today, we've got 15 PC mods in testing. We've got 28 console mods in testing. While well, those four mods were released today, Agritono's got a new large Massey Ferguson. JA Modding's got a smaller Massey Ferguson. At 26 doesn't have a Massey Ferguson. It's Case H. Chopa talks about how his bakery and confectionery are going to work. MRG's Lincoln Creek should be here next week. Plus, Oxygen David shows off Parallax Occlusion on his new FS22 map. Let's check it out. It's ST4 PC. We have the 151-280. Agrimad P431 and P441. American Life Farming. American Shed. D6N LGP. Hollingsfeld. LED Lamp. Lizard 4x8. Lizard FH2015 Cow Trailer. Lizard P431 and P441. Rabbitino. Ridey 300 Cold Machinery Shed Pack. Seasons Geo Barina SP. Seasons Geo Campo Grande MS. And Toscano. It's ST4 consoles. We have the 1120 series, Agrimark American Styled Garage Shed, Almost a Farm, Barrel, Freedow, Bazura, CKS7190, Don2000, Dudley 16T19T Trailer, Estancia San Carlos Map, Famed A Plows, Fiat 70C, Fiat Halls AD7C, Remy GL660, Hardy Interactive Sprayers, John Deere Windrower, K9 Dozer Blade, Dune Interactive Sprayers, Lizard SP700 Salt Spreader, Massey Ferguson 9407S, Massey Ferguson Plow, Wow. Massey Ferguson 7360 AL4 Beta, Old Bell Trailer, Schluter 2500, Solar Shed Panel, Sidewalks, Thornton Farm 19, Wooden Fence 2 Meter Pack, and the XXL Solar Field. All that being said, we still have 28 Mod City waiting to be tested, but the current average waiting time for newly submitted mods is still one workday. In addition to the mods of testing, four new and updated mods were released today on the in-game mod hub, including an auto-unloading customizable trailers and OK Use Mod's new American Shed. I've already made a video showing these up. You can find that video linked in the first pinned comment and description below. Taking our way into today's top stories, and we start with Agritono and their new Massey Ferguson mod, the 8400 series. This large tractor will feature several customization options, including but not limited to fenders and different cabin options. It's also going to be presets for different regions. I'm assuming like North American, South American, European, things like that, but those have yet to be confirmed. They are still working on this mod right now, so if there's anything that you want to see on it, check out Agritono linked in the description below. Let them know what you would like to be added. JA Modding is also working on a new tractor, the Massey Ferguson 680 HD. Working on it right now and say that we'll be getting more information on it soon. Matt 26 has something new for us as well. It's red, but it's not a Massey. This is his new Case IH Axle Flow 1400 and 1600 Combines. That says that there is a few adjustments left to be made on the 1400 model, then you'll be sorting out the 1600 model. Yesterday we showed off some new screenshots of the bakery and confectionery that Shama is working on, and today we get a closer look at how they're going to work. These are going to work like the other factories they have in the game now, so they're going to work via the animal system and you'll be buying them in the animal screen. You're going to have to supply the bakery with natural water and flower pallets. The natural water can be found in the store in 500 liter barrels and the flower pallets care pellets pallets pellet pallets crap the flower pallets can be produced by the flower production in the placeable factories pack these are going to work on shaba shamberg valley and likely his other maps as well with an update although other modders will need to adapt their mod to their maps separately the bakery and confectionery will cost you only fifty thousand dollars have a daily maintenance cost of 50 bucks per day and they're estimated to produce four boxes of 2,500 liters per day. MRG Mapping says that his new map, Lincoln Creek, is going to be here next week. Obviously, with his recent move, he has had very little time to get the map sorted. There was also an issue with the meat production on the map, but that is getting close to being resolved right now. You'll be able to sell cattle, convert that into meat, and sell it on the map. If you're a PC player and excited about Lincoln Creek, it should be here very, very soon. And lastly today, Oxygen David shows off another example of parallax occlusion mapping on his new map for Farming Simulator 22, Court Farms. As you can see here, the pathway on the left leading up to the tractor is pretty bare with not much detail or textures. This is kind of what we're used to now, but the area in front of the tractor going towards the bottom right hand corner of the screen is much more detailed with the rock standing out from the plain dirt path and the grass almost looks then, like it would in normal life, instead of just a flat green patch. This is going to lend to the map looking much more realistic like it would in real life. It should give you a higher sense of immersion. 
making your gameplay experience even better. But it's time to immerse yourself in the self-aware segue to the outro. Just like every episode of Farm Sim News, links to all topics discussed today can be found in the description below. So it really states for mods, myself, nor anyone else knows when any mod is going to be released. If it did not talk about something that you're interested in or curious about, hey TJ, where's the F100? like 30 times a day. That just simply means that there's no new information at the time of recording this video. Please refer to previous episodes for the most current status of those projects, and make sure you stay tuned to the channel for updated information on everything new going on in the world of Farming Simulator. Well, guys, that is going to be it for today. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure you drop a like on it, get subscribed to the channel if you're new, and join the GoHam fam. Make sure you turn your notification bells on as well so that you never miss daily Farming Simulator videos here on the channel. I'll be done. Hope you have a great day. We will see you later. Peace. Yo, I went to Top Golf yesterday and I am sore. Who <laughs> knew playing golf would wear you out?